Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I am here for the very last collab of the year. Um, it is the Christmas 365 collab that is hosted by Bobby Joe and um, Michelle. And we post the last day of each month and it can be anything that is just as long as it's Christmas. Now, I'm kind of glad, I'm glad that this is the last Christmassy type thing that I will be needing to make. I love doing Christmas. That is my very favorite holiday to craft for. But right now I'm kind of Christmas out. I'm ready to get on to some new things. That may be things that are more springy, pastel-y, um, just different things. <laughs> so um, this is a project I had saved on Pinterest and I was going through my Christmas um, board and this is just a little money envelope. It is about a quarter of an inch wide. There's some quarter inch thickness to it. As you can see, it's just like this little box. And then I did seal it with some Velcro. Um, the woman who did the tutorial, she um, gave instructions for like adding magnets, which I wasn't going to do that because for the most part, people will be throwing these away. Um, I don't know, I only made one. It was super quick, easy to put together. Um, but I only made one right now because well, I don't know, I don't want it to get squashed from here until next Christmas. Um, so I didn't really wanna make a whole bunch of them. And plus I wasn't sure who all I would need to gift money to next year. So I just made one right now. Um, but it's real super easy. Um, I can put the link in the description that has the tutorial that I followed. It had all of the measurements for like cutting the papers and stuff. And then the video I watched, I basically just watched it so I could see the construction of the little envelope. Because when there's so many score lines and I know you cut ones away, I always wanna make sure I cut the right ones away. Um, but like I said, she called for using a magnet. I wasn't about to do that because those aren't cheap. I went with Dollar Tree <laughs> Velcro and I did I did add um, art glitter glue behind this piece here because it kept wanting to pull up from the Velcro when I was like opening it up. And then this is just a little sticker, dimensional sticker from Hobby Lobby. I love how shiny and like holographic it looks. Very pretty. And it matched perfectly with, I had this one sheet of paper I don't, I think it might be Paper Studio. I forgot to look at the back side of it. Let me see if I haven't cut that away. Yes, it was some of the Paper Studio plaid with gold foil. So it is one of the more expensive papers because it's considered like a specialty paper, but I probably got it when it was half off. So I paid like a buck for it or 99 cents, but I just thought it was gorgeous and it went really well with that poinsettia sticker and just used a black base on this. And I think it turned out really, really pretty. I absolutely, absolutely love this. So I wanted to thank Bobby Joe and Craft Michelle for hosting this all year long. I have had a great time doing it. Um, it's actually one of the collabs that I've not missed a single month. I've posted something. I'm very thrilled with that. I didn't forget any. <laughs> um, of course, here it is the day before this has to go up and I'm posting, or I'm filming this at nine o'clock at night. But I knew this was gonna be a quick project because I found it at work today when I was scrolling through Pinterest. I said that would be something quick and easy and it's always some, you know, always usable. And so that is my project share for this month. I'd like to thank everyone for stopping by. And um, Bobby Joe, um, in case you didn't see my video from Smasher Stash where I announced the winner for the paper clip the altered paper clip I did and that Christmassy um, stamp set, you were the winner. So um, you can just shoot me your address. I've been meaning to email you and I'm sorry, I just have been forgetting. Um, so if you just wanna send me your address, then I can get those things out to you ASAP. Um, so thank you everyone for watching and I will see you all in the next video in the new year. Hope you all have a great New Year's. Take care.